Yeah. Tomorrow she, night, I promise, suck that dick today, sis. Okay? Uh, a shoulder to cry on is a dick to ride on. Period. It's the weekend. It's the weekend. And I'm trying to get lit. get lit. With a wig, I'm trying to pull up with some friends. Skirt, skirt. Pop bottle at the bottle, get lit. It's lit. It's oh. lit. Just a rolling broken, ain't got time to wait. Time. Tell me why you tripping, what's the situation? Whoa. Baby, it's the weekend. How's everybody doing today? This is Side Do Services. I am Ricky Fontaine. It's your boy King Solo, the DJ, the one and only from the MD to the VA. And to my right, I got three lovely, spontaneous guests. Please introduce yourselves. <laughs> No. Okay. Hey. Everything goes in order. Hey. Everything. We're, we're rolling now, okay? Yeah, so everything yeah. goes in order. <laughs> Unless you just got that ish to say, everything goes in order. Yeah, I have a little problem. I just be blurring stuff. Yeah, yeah, everything, oh, everything goes in order. Say, I got Tourette's. <laughs> so, uh, Something like that. Bear with me. All right, I'll go ahead and start. It's your girl Tori B. Back from the VA with another podcast. It's your girl Jelly Roll. And this is my first time here. What's good? It's your boy OG Tubbo, man. CEO of Atlas Entertainment, Administrative Assistant. It's up, you know what I'm saying? All right, all right. So, I know I just said your names. Mm-hmm. There's also your time to plug. So, you say your Instagram, is any social media accounts, anything you want to do. Like, anything you got to plug, get it out yeah. now. Oh, get it out now. Get it out now. Oh, shit, man. Um, <laughs> let me go to my IG right quick. Do you hear me? <laughs> Why he's looking at IG? Would you like to go first? Follow yeah, me. IG, let's go get it. Um, you can follow me at vs two <laughs> underscores bombshell on Instagram. Um, a YouTube channel is coming soon called House of Tory B, spelled H A U S of Tory B. Check that out on YouTube. I have videos, cooking channel, um, vlogs, and everything. That's me. Okay, Tor. Next. Oh, I'm Jelly again. Um, follow me on Instagram at Keeping Up With Dot Gels and subscribe to my OnlyFans. Twenty five dollars a month. <laughs> she got real props. You know, that's that's like up there. That's like premium content. Type <laughs> Yo, like I said, it's your boy OG Tavo back at it again, man. Make sure y'all follow our team page at underscore A C T U. We got like four, five P's in that jank. Dot E N T. And then follow our other main page. Is it it's four or up. five? Which, which one is you it? You looking at it? Yeah, I'm, saying, <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm just, just fucking with you. Nah, it's four P's. Four P's dot ENT. And then follow our other page. It, it's up ITZ UP dot ENT. That's where y'all gonna know all the parts where we gonna be at. We got one tonight. So y'all pull up and follow my main page at OG dot Tefo. This drops in like two weeks. That's cool. All right. Because we got a party tonight. Just want to throw that out there. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah, like that, when they'll get this and they'll be like, dang, that was two weeks ago. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you missed out. Anyway, go ahead. Club Dosha. If you're in the 7 5 area. Damn right. Yeah, you, fucking Friday. Yeah, there you, there you go. Lit. Yeah, there you go. I got you. <laughs> <laughs> go ahead, fool. Do your thing. All right, so. All y'all viewers out there, I appreciate y'all watching. I appreciate everybody listening. Shout out to everybody on Spotify. Shout out to everybody on YouTube. Shout out to that Patreon. <laughs> Everybody that tuned in, getting that premium content early before everybody else. Um, if you don't know about the Patreon, it's two dollars a month uh, for a subscription. It's mad cheap, and you get all our content exclusive, uh, unedited, explicit beforehand before everybody else. Shout out to everybody on Spotify. I already said that uh, we got clothes now. Get that merch. Let me get that shirt. Get that shirt. Get that shirt. Yeah. So we got we got more than just shirts. We got shirts, hoodies. Hats, all that shit. You see that? The shirt tells you how to be a side nigga. The shirt gives you all the proper details you need to be what you need to be. Mm. And if you don't follow them rules, you just you just terrible. Uh, sad, and, uh, sad nigga. Mm. Make sure you hit that subscription button. Make sure you hit that notification button. <coughs> hit that bell, that like, all that shit. Try to get these comments up. And let's run it. If you're dating somebody, are, are they allowed to say no? When it comes to having sex. Mm. Damn, okay. Yes. If you're married, that's a no. Ooh. Mm. If you're married, I feel like guy or girl should get it whenever they want. But if you're dating, I don't have a ring on my finger. You don't have a ring on your finger. There's no real commitment. I'm still technically single, so yeah. But, oh. Man, look, whatever he don't do, another nigga will. And that's on that. Experience. So he can't say no. So he can't say no. I'm a rapist ass. I'm a good mom. <laughs> Fuck that. 
I'm gonna have to, even if I gotta take it from you in your sleep, I'm getting mine. <laughs> oh, okay, we heard that. Yeah. So she's a rapist. <laughs> we raping right. niggas out here. All right. 2020. Well, you mm -hmm. Shit, I just feel as though, like, shit, I'm gonna get it one way or another. Like, even if I, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna turn her on, you know what I'm saying? Like, she ain't even in the mood, I'm still gonna turn her on. You know what I'm saying? Kiss on the little neck, you know what I'm saying? Mm. But what if she's <laughs> <laughs> Kiss on her period. Her neck ain't on her period. Don't no, fuck. She gonna she gonna throw. What if she's on her period, Ted? Hey, look. Her neck then, work. You hey, got look, your cake ready. Hey, look, I don't fuck with you. That's how I'm gonna be. I'm gonna fuck with you. Neck work. Neck work. Neck work. I'm gonna tell her get down here and give me some hair right quick. Give me right. I don't do that. You don't give hair. Okay. She whoa, whoa. I do I'm gonna give, give my little crush on that one. Like, okay. I do give head, but if I'm on my period and I you want head, I'm not giving you head unless I can get something back so you where there's nothing happening between us that night. You know that for that whole shit. Huh? You know that eating out on your period? Hmm? You know that eating out on your period? Eating what? You never got eaten out on your period. No, it's disgusting. I I ain't never done no shit like that neither when my girl was on her period. You never had huh? sex on your period? I have, but I don't like it. Uh, it's like, unless I'm in the shower, but it's just. Shower sex. Yeah. Yeah, shower sex. Yeah. It's just net. I don't know. So you got eaten out your period because you was about to grab that mic. <laughs> yeah. I'm it was honest. like, it was it was just different. It was just like, it's not like he had his whole fucking face all up down there. It was just like, you know. It's a skill. You got to figure out what you got to know what you're doing. Yeah. She said. <laughs> that was what was going on. Like. <laughs> Keep this shit like that last piece of cheesecake. <laughs> Amen. Can we get any questions? <laughs> this is beyond me. He ain't even answer it yet. I thought you were talking about something totally different. I thought you meant like if you cool with something but she not with it, is it okay to say no? Mm -hmm. Like if he's like or if she like I want you to eat my ass and he like mm -hmm. is no. he allowed to say no? No, I didn't even mean consent. I was like, my whole head, my head went on. Nah, like, say she come home from work, you trying to have sex, yeah. you trying to get some of that zesty pussy, and she wet, like, nah. Wet slobbing pussy, too. But she like, nah, I want that fresh off work, that zesty. She not she, tell me, no. What kind of job she got? I don't know. No, she could be working at the shipyard no, for all I know. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, that's not what I'm asking. Like, Your pussy don't get zesty? Mm. I mean, it does, but that's why you carry wipes with you. Okay, <laughs> fresh off the workout, you ain't in this. He yeah, wants some of that. Like, like, you ain't never fucked a nigga straight coming off of working out, you know, basketball. Like that. What? I take a shower every time before. Uh, see, mm. I'm slower. courteous. I make sure I'm shaved. I make sure I'm clean. Uh, I, make, I mean, like. <laughs> she <laughs> said you bougie. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, but look, that's cool though. But I just feel as though you know what I'm saying. You gotta try. You gotta branch out a little bit. You know what I'm saying. Like every nigga ain't gonna got them. You, know? you gotta make sure to swing the mic to you a little bit. You know what I'm saying, you know what I mean? I'm, my fault, bro. But all I'm saying is that goddamn, you gotta you gotta switch it up a little bit. You know what I'm saying. Like me personally, I like to switch it up a little bit. I want me a little bougie, but I want me a little ratchet too. I want you to tell me like like motherfucker, get your ass down there, eat this shit out. You trip? You feel me? Ain't nothing wrong with a little fur. You know what I'm saying? A little fur. Little fur, yeah, yeah, little, little bushy tail. Oh, yeah, a little, little, little bushy tail. A little I boosie babe. Yeah. I said, like, don't get me wrong. We know we love when it be smelling like you know, little little pink and Victoria's yeah. Secret and all that other uh, shit. You know what I'm saying? Once you get out the shower. <laughs> trigger word. Yeah, that's me. Yeah, that's, that's me right there. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I mean, my name is Victoria. So. Have you ever had anybody dick whipped or mm. pussy whipped? Yeah. 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 Yes, sir. Yeah. Yep. Yes, sir. So ex ex express one of those stories, one of those times, Woo. and how they were just maybe a little too clingy after y'all encounter. Damn. damn. Mm. Story time. Shit. <laughs> um, well, fuck it. I'll go first because I really don't give a fuck about my situation. Go ahead. We got now. <clears throat> it was this one girl. I was going to TCC at the time. Post campus. You know where I met my niggas at. And got now. My counselor had wanted me to tell her daughter. You fucked your counselor. Daughter? <laughs> All right, Can I get to the yeah, story? Yeah, yeah, like right. the story gonna get juicy, y'all. Y'all got questions. <laughs> I'm gonna finish the story. So got now, like I say, her my counselor wanted me to tell her daughter, or whatever, in math, because she was kind of feeling that shit. So I say, boom, I'm gonna look out. Got now, saw her daughter. I'm like, damn, like her daughter bad as a bitch and a mom. I'm trying to fuck both of them, tripping. Mm. So fast forward, <clears throat> got my little date with the daughter. 
finally going out with a daughter or whatever, you know what I'm saying? Next thing I know, one day, her dude's car was fucked up. This wrong day nigga went over there with a whole gray sweat sweatsuit on. Mm. Gray sweatsuit. Y'all know y'all females love that gray sweatsuit. Y'all see dick imprint and everything. Mm -hmm. Quiet on that one. All right, I'm going to fuck with you. <laughs> <laughs> but goddamn, so, mama, as I was leaving, dudes gave me a hug. She touched my dick. I was like, <laughs> all right. Next, about, what, about a week later, came over there. Mama in the, in the kitchen cooking in lingerie. Mm, what? Yes, boy. This shit TV. This shit not real. <laughs> I'm going to tell real shit. Like, anybody can tell y'all this is a true ass story. Like, my niggas even know this is a what true story. What school is this? This is TCC. Boy. Shout out to TCC. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it. So then, when it was uh, when in her, uh, when in the living room, right? This way, it had a little plasma flat screen TV shit. I'm chilling in that bitch. Mama came in there and straight sucked my pulled my dick out and sucked that shit. I was like, yo, Can't shit. wait for my turn. <laughs> 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 Can't wait. <laughs> About two weeks later, I'm fucking the daughter in her room. I ain't know the mama was at the crib. Mm. The mama came in that bitch started spazzing. I said, I said, at this time, you know, it won't know alright, I'm gonna fuck with you. Yeah. It was like, I'm gonna just head out. <laughs> type shit. I'm gonna, I'm gonna uh, put my little worm middle finger up like I'm in church. Yeah. She told me to sit my ass down. She told her daughter, since you fucking in my house and I can hear your ass, we going in this shit together. I was like, what? Yo. <laughs> yo. <laughs> Straight punish both of their asses. That's like Pornhub. Nah, I want no. Nah, that's real life. That's OG That's, that's real life. <laughs> that's where the OG come from. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. But then that's that's when her mama got a little crazy and wanted this shit too much. I was like, yeah, the question was, you ever got somebody dick whipped? That's a crazy, that's a great story. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. So who, that was, who, who was dick whipped? The, the both mama, the both mama. For, well, oh, the most mama. of the mama and the daughter, but yeah. mama was real dick whipped. I don't know what the fuck. Yo, she must have had no good dick in a minute. But all that 10 inches in her ass. Mm. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> you could have left that on the back end. <laughs> we, we, we spent the block at the wrong <laughs> time. <laughs> that's our show, not their show. <laughs> <laughs> you spent the block. I, I don't know. If, I don't know if you promoting the fans only page. <laughs> yeah, uh, basically. <laughs> okay, Miss Jelly. Oh, what is the question? Oh, you ever ha had anybody pussy whip? Or dick whip? Yeah. I'm, 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 did you, you had anybody dick whip? But. Yeah, this person that's calling. Oh, oh. 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 hello. <laughs> hello. I missed something. Oh, that's fucked up. Would you okay, I'm, okay. Hold okay. on. All right, I'm gonna tell you the story. So he's outside, actually. Um, he's Why? 36. Um, so one day, <laughs> Why? we Wait. been at the strip club. I was 18. Is that crazy? Don't let him in, cause I'm talking about him. Um, so I was. He not invited. He not coming in anyway. Okay. Yeah, who else? We got a set. He brought us from my lunch. Oh, the oh. six piece nugget. Yeah. Yeah, the six piece nugget. That's how people are crazy. Y'all just got it. I'm not inviting anybody else to the block. He dropped her off. He dropped her off. Oh. Yeah. I don't know. That's crazy. We're in space. Yeah. Go get your nuggets, man. Let's go get your nuggets. Go tell your story. Come on, let's go get your nuggets, man. Some nuggets, girl. Let's get this man off the premises, man. Tell my story. You can tell your story, story when we come back. We're going to spin right. the block. <laughs> and we're, we're back. back. <laughs> Let's go. So. Come on now. You were telling your story. Have you ever been, have you ever had anybody pussy whipped? Mm-hmm. My 36-year-old friend that's outside. Um, one day, I met him at the strip club. It was like two weeks before my birthday. I was turning 19. I was about to move to Hawaii. And one day, this nigga, um... He just, after the club, I was just like, you trying to go back to your house? So, you know, I did the damn thing. I did the ones and the twos. And then, like, I stopped talking to him. But he just kept fucking calling me. Like, just kept calling, calling. And I picked up, and this nigga was outside my house crying. Like, I was confused. The fuck are you outside my house crying for? Yeah, yeah. So. Different. I went yeah, different. <laughs> Real different. Then after that, he wanted me to move in with him. So then I moved in with him. You know. Whoa, whoa. Oh. Hold. Hold. Breathe. 
Okay. Bree. Get, get right. Bree. Get right. Okay, you Somebody, good. good. Yeah. Sure. I was drinking. You can't be doing that while I'm drinking. That's, that's, uh, that's. <laughs> just, you know, All right, go ahead. 18, living with a 36 year old man, you know, living my best life. You, probably, you about to move to Hawaii. Yeah. I, no, I did, but I wanted to come back because I wanted some dick. Anyways. um. So you was dick with? Nah. I just was like, them Hawaiians, first of all, they're ignorant. It ain't nothing but chickens and roosters that run around Hawaii. Ain't no cats, no dogs. Like, shit, it was dry anyway. Anyways. Mm. Um, okay. So after that, one day he had some girl over there, and I tried to, like, leave or whatever the case may be. And he kicked the girl out, and I was walking to my mom's house. And he got in his car, and he chased me to my mom's house uh, with the window down, hollering and crying, <laughs> yelling out the window. And then he pulled over, it and he kind of, like, Pushed me in the car, mm-hmm. and you've been kidnapped. Yeah, that's, that's, that's like yeah, sex that's trafficking. Yeah, Are you sex good? Trafficking. Yeah. Like, whoa! I got kidnapped at Hampton. He was just like, I didn't do anything with her, and then he pulled his little schmee I mean, out. He was like, I didn't give her none of my meat. I said, you took a bird bath, nigga. I know you did something. Smell my dick. Yeah, that's what he was like. He was like, can you smell my dick? I'm just like, mm mm. I kind of just want to go back. He was like, I'm not letting you leave. I'm gonna kill myself. I was like, wow, whoa. that's deep. <laughs> I'm mad we so tuned in. Like, <laughs> like every time I think it's gonna be over, she say something else. <laughs> then I moved in. What? <laughs> like damn, like really? The, the end. And then I, I met his friend. He had just did like seven years in jail, and I went over there. And his dad was over there, so I ended up fucking his friend and his dad at the same time. <laughs> end of the story. Whoa. I like these stories. Damn right, that story was. It was real. Wait a minute. Can I go last? Because my story not going to be that great. <laughs> <laughs> hey, my nigga. Hey, look. Her story beat mine. Yeah. Mine's... I don't... I feel like she only added that last part just because of his story. Like... <laughs> we all have... If, if we ever looking for a co-host, we're going to call you. Don't even worry about it. No, don't even worry about it. Yeah, we only... This show almost had three people. Remember that? Yeah, I remember that. That was those days. We was looking for that girl, yeah. Yeah. Can I be that girl? Oh, I don't know. You you be having niggas outside my house. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. It was my ride. Yeah, if, if you could just exclude that part. We could. We, we could talk about. Run, it. Yeah. I take an Uber. Run the numbers. He'll pay for the Uber here. Is that better? We work that. We could work. We could work something out, man. Right. Yeah. We, we, we're gonna talk. We're gonna. You remind me of uh, the, the trifecta is gonna talk, and then we're gonna get back to you on that. <laughs> Can I get a free shirt? If I, mean, I do get a part of the. Podcast. Yeah, that's, that's not yeah. That's cool. All right, go. Oh my God. I wanted to go last because my story's not gonna be. Cool. Go. All right, I'll man. Go. Here I'll she go. go. I'll go first. So, what was it like a year ago? You talk about it. Next time I'm not gonna do no timestamps. It was some time ago, long time ago, long, long, long time ago. Anyway, had this junk. I didn't even like her. I didn't like her at all. And uh, basically, I was. Uh, what the fuck happened? I started some party, some crazy shit, and then she's basically like, um, she, she, what the fuck happened? Oh, I took her out to eat. That's what happened. Took the girl out to eat, just to chill with her and shit, and then the whole date was dry as fuck, and shit was whack as fuck. Then, end up, then I was like, fuck it. I didn't even give her a hug goodbye, went to my car, left. Damn. Yeah. So, then she hits me up that night, and it's like, hey, you wanna come over and watch TV or some shit like that? I'm like, it's like 10.30, 11. Obviously, it's not TV. So I'm like, whatever. So I go back. So I go down to the crib, go to the house or whatever. And um, she looks worse now than she did before. Mm. So now, she on crack? Nah. She, <laughs> she's actually she overweight. She's on crack. But nah, she just, she just looked sloppier. That's mm. all. Mm. Anyway, <clears throat> so then I'm there. Uh, basically, I was like, all right, whatever. I'm already here. I might as well hit. So right. I hit. So then... Um, Afterwards, so the whole time when I hit, she run around the whole room. She like, stop! I can't take it. I don't want to do this anymore. No, blah blah. I'm like, bitch, stop fucking moving. I'm right. And then she's like, just give me. I need a break. Five seconds. Five minutes. I need a break. I need a break. Worst sexual experience of my life. And then she said she don't suck dick. Whoa. I don't know if you watch the show, but if you don't suck dick, that's a that's a problem. Damn right, a major problem. Super problem. Like I can't fuck with you. So then. So then, uh, after this, I'm like, I'm gonna give her a second chance. Like, hopefully, that was just like a bad, bad experience. Yeah. yeah. So next time is at my crib. 
I I hit same shit happens. I'm like I'm totally done with this joint. Then like uh like she blowing my phone up, hit my phone like hey, she's like um oh let's go here to my dates and shit and shit like that. I'm like no, I'm not with it. I don't want to do none of that shit. Mm-hmm. She like nah, I'm I'm like I'm, I'm like she like nah, I'm serious like. I just, I just want to get dick one more time. Just one more. I won't run. I promise I won't run. I won't pro- I promise I won't run. I'm like, no, nah, I'm good. She's like, please, 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 please. I said, no, nah, I'm good. And then she's like, why? I don't understand. I'm like, bitch, pussy trash. Your head game trash. Everything about you is trash. I, you look like trash. I don't want nothing. I don't want to so fuck with you. Right? That's so fucked up. Couldn't talk to my, couldn't talk to my daughter like that. Hell, if I nah, had a daughter, you couldn't talk trash. to my daughter like that. Trash. I, no, so, I'm not, no, no cap. And then it was crazy. You was there. You remember that? What? When we was in the car? Yeah, no. I'm no. not going to lie. Anyway, he was there. And she knew he was there. Mm. And I, I was like, I think he started laughing at some crazy shit. And then, so then she's like, so she's like, so we, we can't have sex anymore? I'm like, no, <laughs> no, I'm I'm completely done. I'm I'm a. I don't know if you noticed, but I just said your pussy trash, head your head trash, everything about your trash. Dang. Then she loves. She want like a deployment or some shit. Then right before she get back from the deployment, she hit my ass up like, hey, what's going on? How you doing? I'm like, why are you hitting my phone? Like I literally just she's like, I just want to let you know I'm coming back in town. I'm like, I literally just told you. Or oh, last time we had a conversation, I said your whole body trash. Why are you hitting my phone again? That's the girl that's dick whip. Mm-hmm. Your turn. Okay, so it's not gonna be that great, but I'm gonna get to the point. Mm-hmm. So basically, I was were we dating? I don't know. Let me think about it. Was I dating this guy? I don't know what the situation was, but anyways, it was this guy. He went to Norfolk State. Um, and it's I was, you? Yeah, I was at Hampton, and I met him through a friend. And like he, uh, I'm gonna reveal myself if I give too many details. Okay. Everybody knows who you are. You're on camera. I know that, like, but it's like... <laughs> Reveal <okay>. myself. <laughs> yeah, okay. So, anyways, the guy... I'll, I'll put it like this. Before this time, I wasn't really into bald guys. Oh, he was bald? Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. So, like, I was kind of like, I don't know about this. He bald. Like, I don't know. I don't think I can do it. And then... He was really sweet, though, but he had a high-pitched voice. And his voice was just so, like... He just sounds so, like, soft. And I need somebody that's going like aggressive yeah like like you know like (laughs) (laughs) i need i need somebody who's going like make me feel like ooh, he's a man like i need you to like mm, take control so anyways getting to the point basically Mm -hmm. we start talking we're dating whatever and like i went i took him to a church valentine's day dinner and everybody there was just asking me all these questions, saying, like, what's going on with him? Is he your boyfriend? Blah, 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 blah. And he's all like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm like, nah. I shouldn't have brought you here. So, anyways, after that, I was kind of, like, texting him less and less and less. And he kept on hitting me up. And he was trying to come to my house. And I was like, no, I don't think we should do this anymore. I'm done. So, I live all the way in Hampton. He drove from Norfolk to Hampton and started banging on my door at my apartment. Yeah, and I was... I missed the part where you gave him pussy, didn't you? Yeah, Oh, yeah, like... I did. Oh, oh, okay, I forgot that part. Yes. Okay, so, like... Oh, every... I'm about to say, you did all of this off of yeah. mental stimulation? Yeah. Oh, like, oh. No, no. Okay, okay. <laughs> so we had sex. So when did we... How did, How was our sex? It was pretty good. He had a big thing, but it a just... A big thing. Mm. Yeah, but it just wasn't... He won't... What you needed. Yeah, he gave me good head. I gave him some head. But, like, it just wasn't a lot of force. It was just very soft. Oh, and you I like just, that aggressiveness. Like, bitch, like, choke me, pull my yeah, hair type shit. That I want somebody to, like, beat it up. Like, that's what I want. And he just wasn't <laughs> doing that. Like, oh, oh, shut up. Leave me alone. I'm trying to tell my story. Go ahead. Go ahead. Man. <laughs> All right. So, like, he wasn't really beating it up like that. He was just kind of taking it. I feel like I was giving it to him because I was riding it. And he was, like, moaning like a girl. And I Whoa. Was, uh, that nigga moan? Moan? Mm-hmm. Y'all yeah, moan? Nah, nigga. Uh, I about to say, it, 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 it depends nah. on how, how, how like, the tight the pussy uh-huh. is. I'll grunt. I don't moan. No, he was yeah, moaning. Yeah, I'm like, grunt. Like, oh, okay, I, I can yeah. respect that. I can respect that. He was moaning, grabbing my back. And I was like, well, he must really like this. He was this. grabbing your back. Back. <laughs> moan. <laughs> 
Too much is going on. Whoa, whoa, what? <laughs> yeah, we were on the floor because the bed was making too much noise. So, like, we had to get on the floor. Oh, the neighbors was trying to stay with your name that night. Huh? You stayed with your mama? Or I stayed in my apartment. Nah, she was. She won't try to so, let the neighbors so know. Who cares if his bed's making yeah. too much noise? Because I lived. I lived in the. I lived in the harbors at the time, and uh-huh. like you know, people. Oh, uh, uh, you want to oh, You try, You want to be known? Yeah. You want to be known as a freak freak? Exactly. Oh, okay. But if you a freak freak, you a freak freak. I That's lived, what I'm saying. I lived That's underneath an alpha who I knew. He was very well known, so I did not want him to know who I was fucking with because it was more people I had on the side. So like, I didn't want nobody to know. Said, what I was doing You got me fucked up, up. Yeah. We, we fucking on the bed And you gotta be like Yeah 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 We now we gotta go to the floor Real quick It's making time I'm gonna your ass down But she said He wasn't aggressive Yeah so. I was the one Breaking him He wasn't breaking me So basically I just was getting tired of it And like he was bald. I wasn't in the bald guys At the time No offense So oh. I'm sorry No offense but, Roll Shout out to the bald man I like and I'm just saying because you bald, so like nothing's wrong with being I bald. But he, here. his head was shiny bald, like it was. That's what I'm trying oh, to like be. Like the Kunta Kinte oil Mr. type bald. Yeah, like and he was very, he, looked, he didn't have any other facial <laughs> hair. Oh, so, he, that's weird. Yeah, so shiny. I was kind of like, he looks like an egg. <laughs> but anyways, so like he popped up in my house, and I felt like maybe I should give him some closure, so I let him in, and we talked, and he was like, "So I don't understand why you blocked me, why you're not talking to me, blah 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 blah." And I was like, "I'm done." And he just kept on calling me. He was weirdos. mad at me. No cap. Huh? Niggas are weirdos. Yeah, he was crying. Mm. I felt bad, but. Wasn't enough, so that's what I told y'all. My story wasn't that entertaining, but I was I was insane. Very interesting. All right, so we like to sign out. Um, (laughs) so yeah, for right now we're gonna sign out. We're gonna run it. We're gonna gonna spin the block on this group. Um, before we sign out, just any advice you like to give people out there? Your mental health is very important. Take care of yourself. If you need to go therapy, go to therapy. Just because you're black doesn't mean you have problems and God will fix all of them. God fixes oh, she everything. Advice, right? advice. But at the end of the day, if you need to be diagnosed, if you have a mental health issue that you're not talking about, you need to talk to someone. If you feel like you want to commit suicide, contact that one eight eight hundred help number and get some help. Yeah. All right. All right. Then. Tomorrow, not promise. Suck that dick today, sis. Okay. Uh, a shoulder to cry on is a dick to ride on. Period. That that gotta go somewhere. I don't know. In the beginning of the video, I don't know. Beginning, it gotta go somewhere. That that that's. I think it's gonna go in the beginning of the video. Just like that. Yeah. Song play. Hey, look, man. All I say is, goddamn, just just make sure everybody good. Make sure you happy with anything. You know, relationship or signings. Make sure you happy within yourself, and it's something that you really want to do, man. Real shit. Cause. You only live once, goddammit. You know what I'm saying? You're yellow. Uh, Vice, uh, we ain't talk about it much. Um, so if you are, if you think you might be a victim of pussy whipped, <laughs> or you think you might be a victim of the dick whip, <laughs> please dick understand whip. that it's 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 not your fault. Ooh, the, the, the box is crazy. It's not, not your fault. Your the dick fault. Is that good. Or the pussy. Yeah, it's not your fault. It's her fault. It's his fault. <laughs> so, <laughs> 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 it's the boss. Hey, uh, uh, for the whole day, yeah. I'm gonna get lazy. Yeah, I'm done. <laughs> Girl, <laughs> all right, all right, man. One more time. I am Ricky Fontaine. From my family to your family, man. Y'all have a blessed day, man. Yo, they sober. Huh? <laughs> yeah, we sober as hell. Tryna get lit, get lit. With a wind, tryna pull up with some friends. Skirt, skirt. Pop bottle at the bottle, get lit. It's lit, oh. It's, lit. it's the weekend. weekend. And I'm tryna get lit, get lit. With a wind, tryna pull up with some friends. Skirt, skirt. Pop bottle at the bottle, get lit. It's lit, it's oh. Lit.